Okay. Yes. <laughs> yes. We are back with Holy Cow. Um, a cup of coffee. Down Ash Vampires. Ah. And of course, oh my god, sure. We've got a lovely ice up. Bad. Oh my god, I'm gonna Probably the no, definitely the longest running game I, I've been playing. I've uh, been playing it for uh, a quarter of a millennium, <laughs> 25 years now. Um, this is a kind of new account. Because I don't want to give away my um, main account um, identity. I just don't want to do that. Um, but it's always fun to, to create a new uh, character, an entirely new account. Then again, we are already, I think, level 16 or something? 18, maybe? Um, yeah, so I think we should dive right into it and tune up the volume a bit. Last time I was streaming, the in-game music was a bit too loud, but I think it's okay. Yeah, I think it's okay. Okay, let's dive right in. We are playing on Ascension uh, server. That's usually the most populated. Heroes, that's where my main account sits, is kind of deserted with four players online. <laughs> so that does it. That means you, you won't run into uh, a player. Well, except maybe in uh, uh, the hunting grounds. Legends is pretty populated as well. It's pure PvE and Chaos uh, server is just uh, it's only an event server. So let's dive right into Ascension. We've got four slots uh, to fill with different characters. I only made just one character called the Innkeeper. And we're gonna load him up. Oh, that's level 16. Yeah, and the problem is, um, <laughs> because the game is so old, it has some difficulties running on uh, higher resolution screens. I've got a 27 inch screen here running at. Uh, what was it? Uh, nope. 2.60 times 40-40. Um, that's actually way too, way too high. <laughs> Resolution, uh, the text is getting a, a bit blurry. I'm used to it in the meantime uh, because I mean I have I, I know where to look <laughs> and we have that art uh, I don't know if you can see it but I can see it in Twitch studio we have a bar at the bottom and on the top but that shouldn't be much of a problem um, yeah, I was just mining a, a little bit, trying stuff out, rearranging the windows, etc. But today, it's gonna be the day 
<laughs> no, I'm, I won't sing, I promise. See, that's what I mean, it's all blurry. Fourth sister, level 17. Um, yeah, today we're gonna hunt a bit and leveling up our, uh, where is it, small blade uh, skill. I'm gonna put it right, uh, right here maybe. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good. Um, we are in fact totally under equipped, but that shouldn't matter because we have coffee. No, because we we won't hunt uh, big uh, creatures. Well then, you look like a brave adventurer. Oh yeah, I do. Yeah, sure. Do you have the time to learn uh, the Latorian Knights? <laughs> that's, that's a rather interesting question for a player like me. <laughs> King Lotto commissioned the Knights to defend his realm from evil. Yep. Lately we have been focused on controlling the hordes of monsters that have been terrorizing the land. Makes sense. My, miss my mission is to clear this region of these insidious creatures. It appears you are a young adventurer. Mm -hmm, I am. Well, my character is. The task I will give you should be very easy. Okay. Um, insidious creatures. The Latorian Knight asks you to slay 40, 40 skeleton mages. Didn't you just say that it would be very easy? I mean, skeleton mages are not that easy at all. They're not. Okay. Anyway, uh, we still need to find them. I'm actually not sure where to find them around. Crack the Arkish starting town, but we will see. I'm just running into the wild without much armor on me. Just a small blade. A flame arrow that gives some light and let's just start to kill some bats okay that's that's a one hit ha. I'm going to collect yeah I'm going to collect everything because I need the money you know um, those Bad ears uh, is actually pretty useful for alchemy later. Raw silk. Uh, you can spin it into uh, silk threads and then weave them into silk cloth and make silk bandages that help you with <clears throat> padding with uh, first aid. Come on, that. I can barely see it. Let's switch back. There's so many funds, but let's just switch back to. That. No, that made it even worse. To Ariel. And we already have the the biggest uh, font size so yeah it's blurry but it's gonna be okay it's gonna be okay a 
filthy sludge. Come on. That even gives me 200 uh, bonus experience and some cloth. Nice. Yeah, we have a, a power hour weekend. Um, well, it's Monday here, so I'm not sure how long that weekend uh, will last, but we will see. <clears throat> and those power hour, power hour uh, weekends really help because you get, I think it's 50% bonus experience. A rabbit food, yeah, that should bring us good luck, I hope. I'm just checking on help. Okay, now we're good, we're good. There are just filthy sludges and the occasional spider. I love to hunt spiders at low levels. Mm -hmm -hmm. Stop it! <laughs> because you drop uh, silk. And silk will turn out pretty useful, trust me. Kindlings, not so much. You can let. I'm gonna show you. How was it? There, was, there it is. Uh, yeah, you can let a fire with just one kindling. And bam, you have a campfire. Isn't that cool? And you can even cook your spider legs. And that campfire. Woohoo, made it. We cooked two. Failed one. Uh, cooking is based on intelligence and we only have uh, strength at the moment, but the failure rate is actually pretty low. Gonna kick the bat wings as well. Food gives you some uh, benefits. Um, I totally forgot which food gives which benefit. But we, we're gonna see. Oh. oh, the campfire warms you and you get plus one stamina regeneration. Okay, that's cool. So we ate uh, a bad wing, a cooked one. Oh, crap, crap. And it adds one point to dexterity. That's not much, but it's still better than nothing. Oh, come on. Get down already. Nope. No bonus experience. <clears throat> Red tails are useful for um, alchemy as well. Those spider legs increases our intelligence for just one point, but still, that's okay. And the bonus doesn't add up. That means you can't eat a uh, hundred uh, spider legs and expect to gain a, a hundred intelligence bonus. I mean you can eat a hundred 
<laughs> then what? Won't, won't help. Yeah, those filthy sludges give good uh, bonus experience, overall experience. Rid the land of 17 foul vermin for the captain of the guard, but <laughs> that captain of the guard is on uh, Valinor, and we can't get back to that, so that quest is actually not really uh, finishable, so to say. Riddles are a bit harder, but then again, they drop gems that you can sell for, for money. Uh, and those triddle shells aren't worth that much, so I'm just gonna leave them in the corpses. Well, okay, I should check my health every now and then. And yeah, my carrying capacity. But that's. That's a 280, if I read that right. Because it's so blurry. Oh, come on. Oh, okay, that was a non-hostile um, enemy, that rabbit. I couldn't target it because I had target protection on. <laughs> Abraxas says, What fool disturbs my slumber? I shall soon devour the heart of Cello. Okay, so someone is... <clears throat> Obviously, taking on uh, 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 Braxis. That's quite a big boss. Uh, absolutely not doable solo. Forget it. Just forget it. Like, seriously. <laughs> um, yeah, I should bank my stuff. And I so love the music, you know. Hey, maybe cook it. Maybe cook it first. Uh, I'm totally lost in crock, I admit. Oh. That looks like an oven. Yeah. So now we can cook those bat ears, uh, bat wings. And have a coffee. And six more spider legs. And we're gonna sell it. Sell it, not salad. Yeah. There's no salad in the game. Cabela is selling all types of arrows in bulk. Yeah, of course you're not selling them one by one. <laughs> Come on. Um. <laughs> So, yeah, we're gonna sell the kindlings. 
the cooked legs, that rabbit hood as well, not the red tail, but the gems, the onyx. And we got a nice 500 gold. And we should probably invest in some armor. Let's see. I mean, we've got a bit more uh, gold in bank. We've got 44,000 gold. We definitely need a shield, but not a golden one. I mean, that's good uh, armor, but it's so heavy. I'm gonna stick with that normal shield, I think. Then we need uh, some good uh, leggings. You don't want to go for gold because it's yeah it's really just too heavy. A rock plate mail. Then we need some good gloves, plate mail gloves, and maybe a fancy. Battle Helm. Yeah, that should do the trick. Oh my god, that's so heavy. And I'm not even sure where my inventory is. Oh, there it is. If we can uh, use all of that. Oh, yeah, we, yeah, we can. Okay. We now have, uh, let's see, 96 armor compared to, let's switch back, to 49, so that almost doubled our armor rating. Nice. And we're gonna sell it. Sell it. Is there anything else? Yeah, we could use rings and, and boots. Okay, um, let's check. Whoa. Ah, no, we're gonna spin that later. Let's check for rings first. to find them. I love the sound of the board drums in crack. Ah, Miss Mouse. Okay, that's just food stuff. Woodworking stuff. I don't think we will, we will get uh, any rings here or boots. So we're gonna bank uh, the silk and the gold we got. Whoop. Ears. There you go, into that knapsack here. Same with the silk. And maybe we should place the red tails here as well. And the cloth. Yeah. That's far from perfect, but. 
we're gonna buy some some chests later. Or maybe wait for Hyax. Oh, and away, Hyax! Hyax, where are you? <laughs> he usually shows up when I'm playing Ashen Empires. You don't have a friend list here, uh, you do have uh, a guild system, but um, no friend list. Too bad. Yeah, that's the portal to Lotor's uh, Summer Palace, which leads to different other towns, some of which are unavailable for us. Oh god. This is so heavy. Okay, here are at least skeletal pups. That means the mages can't be found. And every time you uh, finish a quest for the Lotori Knights, you get experience pool that you can spend on uh, weapon skills. Oh, skeleton bones. They're for alchemy, right? Yeah, they are. Yay! And I'm a novice killer of insects. Hooray! Yeah, you need those ranks later on in the really late game. When you want to take on uh, dragons. Yes, there. There are dragons in Ashen Empires. Pretty cool dragons. <gasps> oh, shoot. Should have <laughs> checked my health. Ah. Hold on. Problem is that I'm poisoned. <laughs> and yeah, even the best armor can't prevent that. You need uh, poison and disease resistance. Good thing is that um, poison usually wears up, uh, wears out pretty, pretty fast. It does more damage per tick than disease, but it wears out more quickly. So. Yeah, I think it does quite exactly the same damage as, as disease. Might do the math. Let's bank all the stuff and get some health back in the meantime. Yeah, and maybe even Maybe even buy some bandages, you know. Get our um, first aid skill up. Okay, that knapsack is full. Oh, and we have a shield to sell. Nice. Hmm. What else? Yeah, I think that's all. And we're gonna buy some some bandages. Just selling the, the uncooked uh, meat. We need that blacksmith hammer later. 
No, I'm not going to buy 30,000. I'm going to buy a hundred. Wait, wait. Why can't I type? Okay, that way. That's not even that heavy. So let's try out the bandages. Yeah, failed. <laughs> That's the problem with bandages. There is a chance that you fail and you don't heal. Whereas healing pots always heal for a set amount of uh, health points. That wasn't always the case. They always heal, but for uh, yeah, a va variety of uh, health points. I'm getting crappy heals. <laughs> oh yeah. During a hell hunt. That was pretty fun. Yeah, filthy sludges are way easier to tank now. Way easier. Hold on. Yeah, 250 bonus experience. Uh, I think we're just gonna uh, level up small blades until we hit Level 17, that's 40,000 experience to go. That's, in fact, not much, you know. Yeah, we made uh, level 7 small blades, so we might head back to town and, and, and see if there is a better small light we can use. Because that would result in us high, uh, leveling faster. Let's just get all those uh, filthy sludges on the way. Come on. That's getting really slow, I think. Yeah, I'm doing a, another stream later. <laughs> no, it's not going on. I'll be online. Still recovering from from my losses from last time. Oh my god, that was awesome. All that stuff I lost. Oh shoot. Yeah, always checking my health. What's in there? Just the rabbit food. can totally use uh, bad ears. And a garnet. Hooray. Let's check. We made 2000 experience. Yeah. Power hour. No.
I could bring uh, a skinning knife. Huh. And skin that carcass. Some mobs leave uh, carcasses for you to skin. Uh, depending on, on your skinning level, that is based on uh, dexterity. You can uh, skin leather and make stuff out of it, like slings or leather armor, even magical leather armor, toad eyes. Yep. <laughs> but they are useful for alchemy as well. And I will definitely uh, delve into alchemy. Once I get my intelligence up. But that's gonna take it some time, I think. Ah. Yeah, well, marsh lights a, a bit. Just a bit too strong at the moment. Come on, get down already. Yeah, uh, for my next stream, I'm, I'm trying to not break a record. I think there are people who already broke it. Um, Sub Zero, DDF, etc. Oh, an emerald that—that's worth a thousand one hundred gold. That's that's neat. Come on, like Edder, just die already. Did that give me uh, nope it didn't give me any bonus experience shoot okay okay slowly heading back to town to check afflicted peach tree okay come on let's take on that Marsh light. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's going down. And it's going down faster than we do. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! And 290 bonus experience. I always wonder, wondering what that strange dust, dust do. Except selling for five gold. Wow. Another toad? Come on. Yeah, okay. I got diseased. Whoa, 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 okay. I just hope I make it. Okay, 64 HP. Cobalt mages. They. Whoa! They hit like real hard from afar. And I just realized I totally went into the wrong direction. And I'm so gonna die. I'm so gonna die now. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I mean dying is part of, of Ashen Empires. And it's in fact no big deal. As long as you don't die uh, far away from your spawn point. You can always run back. Oh, hold on. I even got 
fully selected, you died for the first time. Okay. Maybe that's why. Yeah, but haha. <laughs> okay, I see. Every time you die, your gear wears out a bit. Um, the gear we are wearing now is replaceable. Absolutely replaceable, so that's no big deal. It just costs money over time, uh, gold over time. But I think that was the uh, you died for the first time bonus. <laughs> the next time we're going to die, we have to run back to our body and retrieve the items. You drop everything in your backpack and depending on your reputation, you drop uh, one and up to every uh, equipment you're wearing. Oh, cool. Now, there are rings, but they're too high level. Okay, level 8 ring, a signet ring, gives us a plus 2 constitution. Plus uh, times two. That's four constitution. A choker. Plus two all stats. And twenty HP. Nimble fingers. Okay, we need 30 decks and we don't have that. So we probably should stick to that um, black uh, opal flame. And those signets rings. Two, uh, that's only one in store and buying that one, yeah, sure. Selling our crap. <laughs> okay, we are getting low on uh, gold. But then again, we have now a bonus of two strength, two dexterity, two intelligence, and four constitution, plus 20 HP. So, yeah, that's, that's totally acceptable. Maybe buy a wedding ring. No, that's too expensive for just 10 protection. No, no way. Uh, we still need some gold for uh, our small blades. We are at level 7 small blades using a short stiletto. That got a DPS of hold on, uh, 4.86. No, it's still way, 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 way too um, low level. We, we really need to get our small blades up. Still got almost zero resistances. 
So we gotta be careful around uh, scorpions, toads, spiders. Well, spiders not so much, but everything that can poison or disease you. That's banquet. Yeah, and let's not forget our first aid skill. We could put some e pool, uh, experience pool, into first aid, but. Uh, no. We're gonna save that for, um, I don't know, leadership. You can have uh, pets that follow you. Wolves are pretty useful and in low area uh, against low area maps. Man, I need auto loot. Really. But speed things up real fast. But Hyax is not there, and so. Yeah, no, he isn't. He would have said hello in the meantime. So let's just take it on. Like, easy vermin. And the occasional uh, hired mops. Like that toad. Yeah, got disease, but I'm at almost full health, so I'm gonna survive that. Now it would be a good idea to use some bandages. Yes. Level two and your first aid skill. There's no need for healing. Okay, cool. And the higher your first aid skill is, the more health you uh, regain from uh, bandages. Blood roots can even cure uh, diseases and, and poison. And blood root bandages even more so, but they're pretty difficult and pretty expensive to, to make. Um, same with blood roots actually I was thinking about doing a, a pure end character a second one uh, just to do some uh, you know the smelting and farming but then again I'm thinking about going 100 strength and then going 100 intelligence so yeah, that wouldn't be a good idea because I would have to split the experience between two characters. What's that? And that's a beer tap. Oh, and a skeleton, a level 10. Let's see. Uh, we should use blunt weapons actually against skeletons but small blades will do it I just hope we get bonus experience nope 
skeleton bones are useful for alchemy as well, so we're gonna take those as well. And we are close to level 8. Now we are level 8 and small blades. Well, why does a toad wear a small shield? I didn't get it, but okay. It sells for a hundred gold. That's cool. And the next skeleton. Okay, that's a nice place. Just to level our uh, small blades up. Come on, get down. Get down already. Thank you. And healing up a bit. Fail to heal myself. Okay. Failed again. You healed yourself for 63 points. That's actually pretty good at first aid level 2. Mind you, goes up to 100. And we're just using plain bandages, so yeah. I think they tweaked it. <laughs> okay, a toad wearing a war hammer. That's worth a thousand, almost a thousand three hundred gold. That's some nice loot. Those triddles uh, usually drop uh, shells and occasionally uh, gems as well. So I like to hunt them. Yeah, see? An onyx. And they sell for 70 per. Oh, come on. Done with you already. <laughs> and we still need 33,000 experience. We should go after those uh, toads. on that trill. After that stream I need some time to to set up uh, another game. Um, I need to switch um, Steam accounts because that one is running, uh, Ashen Empires is running on a different Steam account. So, uh, not to mess with my main account. Yeah. Oh, shut up. Excuse me. What's that? Just some breaking report. Uh, local stuff, so 
probably not very interesting for you. I could maybe just... Yeah. I love my rolling chair. <laughs> so comfy. Yay, I'm a spider for some silk. Oh, Miss Mouse. Uh, checking our health. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Even though we got a war hammer loot, a shield, a small shield. Yeah, but we're still good. We've got 45 strength. That's worth the bonus. And those filthy sludges give us some bonus experience of 230. Once you're, uh, you're a higher level, <laughs> filthy sludge goes berserk. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and a sapphire. Nice. That's selling for 780. Uh, our backpack is full. So we're gonna unload it. Selling all that stuff. Or banking it. Banking the alchemy stuff. And the silk and the cloths. And selling the gems. Who's that? Okay, that's an NPC. <laughs> I see. Um, yeah, toad eyes. Go right there. Ah, uh, well, that was wrong. Um, cloth. Torn silk bandages. Okay, we can use them for alchemy later. I definitely need um, some containers. Rat tails. Oh, come on. I'm gonna sell that stuff. The is for uh, farming. Yeah, selling the, the tools at least. Yeah, that looks better. Did we forget something? Um, nope. So we're gonna unload everything we can sell it oh yeah we forgot the silk to bank the silk and the skeleton bones we're gonna save that blacksmith hammer wow nice 1400 gold not too shabby. Hold on. Yeah, they, they, those are blessed. Come on, let's just drop them. And let's drop that smock. Yes. I'm gonna destroy it. I'm that evil. Okay, um, banking the gold, first of all, 34,000 gold, looking good, looking good. So 
So back to hunting. You still need 30,000 experience. Oh my god. Good thing is that we have a power hour weekend. And we got those filthy sludges here that we can take on. Yeah, we can even take on two. No problem. As long as they don't disease. <laughs> that one <laughs> went berserk as well. Going berserk. If 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 a mob goes berserk, that means that he uh, or it. Oh, our first rune! Hooray! Even I, an idol of honor. That's one of the most important, most useful runes you can get. Yeah. Um, if uh, a mob goes berserk, that means that it doubles uh, its um, um, speed attack. Which can be pretty nasty. And another onyx. Nice. Thank you very much. And a kindling. Yeah, we made a thousand two hundred experience. Both these sludges really pay off. That one was empty. Yeah, let's dive and to the west. Just not running away too far from the spawn point. Just in case. <laughs> yeah, okay. R Crop rats don't give bonus experience. But plague toads do. I think. Yeah, they do. Come on. Three hundred and seventy. Wow. And another toad. That's gonna be toast. Badum. That one, I admit. But 370 bonus experience is nice. Definitely nice. Oh, a toad and a skeleton on our tail? That could turn out interesting. But the toad is down. So we only have to deal with the skeleton now. And the skeleton goes down faster than we do. But not giving us any bonus experience. And uh, now it's time to, to heal up again with our bandages. We are now healing for 70 points. Awesome. The occasional triddle. That's not whittle. To put in the middle. Ooh, ha, ha. <laughs> uh, 
even travels, even though his travels give bonus experience. Good. And we are close to uh, level 9 small blades. It's really going up pretty fast. I mean, in terms of uh, Ashen Empires. Level 3 first aid skill. Come on. And level 9 in our small blade skill. That idol would sell for 200 gills, but we will save it. We are deceased. Not deceased, but diseased. So we should probably heal ourselves with some bandages just to counter that um, disease. We, we are healing for 75 points now. Up to 75. Five points. Okay, back at full health. Yeah, that's a pretty neat way to, to recover health. Especially at low levels and especially when you're low on, on gold. Because healing parts are really, really, really expensive. And at my level, I would only use them in a case of emergency. But since we're not far away from um, our spawn point, we should be good. Another rat tail, and there was skeleton and a plague toad. Okay, wow, that's that's one aggressive skeleton. <laughs> Great, you're deceased. Uh, the problem with disease is that it not only takes. Uh, away your your health over time but also your stamina stamina doesn't uh, recover as long as you're diseased so okay that disease wore out yeah you really want to get rid of of disease as soon as possible Seventy one points, seventy six. Getting good heals. There's a trivial and another plague toad coming right up to us. Thank you. Oh, two onyxes. We've got how many? Three of them already. Good. Yay. Diseased again. Afflicted sedentary. Okay, that's. Yeah, I, I still don't have a house, I know. That afflicted cedar tree. That's uh, a, a quest item. Or a quest tree. There's a quest giver. 
who tells you to uh, gather samples of those uh, trees and you have to chop them. But we're not going to do that. Oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. That was probably a bad idea. Oh, shoot. I better run. I better run. <clears throat> Shaking off uh, mobs in, in Ashen Empire is, is actually pretty hard. You have to run uh, diagonally. I mean, from top left, uh, bottom left to top right, and vice versa. Yay, a leather back. That's useful. Because we got another eight slots now. That we can quill and a topaz. So we're just gonna put the the gems into that leather bag. Yeah, that looks neat. Yeah, and maybe the room. Time to heal a bit. And we still need 21,000 experience. But we're gonna get there. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry. Yeah. Those bats are not attacking us anymore because we're too high levels. And they know exactly that they don't stand a chance. A plague toad and a skeleton. That worked out well the last time, so it should work out now as well. We are diseased, but <laughs> I think we used it. Oh, quickly healing up a bit. Nice. Uh oh, that's gonna be close. That's gonna be real close. Uh oh. Uh oh. Whew! Made it. <laughs> okay, let's heal up. And we are level 4 already. And first aid. Healing for 74 points now. Should go up a bit higher. Yeah, we are back at full health. And can totally take on that skeleton. Just checking the experience. Wow, that goes up so fast. 20,000 experience left for level 17. Ouch. Ouch. Come on. A skeletal pet. Okay. Yeah, small blades don't do much damage against uh, skeletons. skeletons.
Which makes sense, somehow. I mean, you know, stabbing a dagger against a skeleton. Just doesn't sound right. Not going to take that triddle shells. What's up there? What's that? Oh, that's brown triddle. Yeah, you can always hope for a gem. Like that onyx? Ha <laughs> ha! Told ya! Oh, so many trills here. I should go a bit south. Where those plague toads are because they give us some nice bonus experience. A trill wearing a purple shield? Okay, but then again, it's worth, worth uh, 1,100 gold. Hold on, protection 15. Protection 15, okay, that doesn't make a difference. So... Where are those toads now? Oh, here's one. I just love the sound. Uh, well, I was just trying to turn up, uh, to tune up the, uh, the, the volume of the music, the soundtrack, because I so love it. But that means I have to press escape and as soon as it's, I said press escape I'm going uh, out of attack mode ah, no yeah that's better I think no that's a bit too loud Yeah, 50 is enough, I think. Oh, slimy ooze? Really? Yeah. Nope, no bonus experience for that. Hyux! Where are you? Nowhere to be found. And we need sixteen thousand uh, experience for level seventeen. And we are close to level 10 in small blades, and that was good loot, actually. Yeah, selling for 200 and 250 gold. That poison potion. Okay, they are just low level mobs, but once again, we've got a poison potion, a very small one, but still. Yay, plate toad. Yeah, 
Yeah, we are far, still far from the, uh, I don't know, tilting point. It usually is at, uh, comes at level 45. I think it's 45, yeah, but you, you're at uh, 100th rank. And you can actually wear most armor and wear uh, most uh, weapons. Usually, um, hunting Talisarian warriors, then they get really nice loot. And we are level 10 small blades, like uh, now, yes. And we even made Hunter of Vermin, nice. But then we are diseased, so we better heal up. Seventy-six points. Good win. Good win. Oh, I so love the music. So many fun memories. And I especially love the uh, transitions between those uh, different tracks. And a marsh light. <laughs> Does that give us bonus experience? Yes, 266. Ah, I'm, I'm just gonna leave that. Strange dust. It's not even worth picking up. The silkers, the spider legs are worth picking up. Now, all those toads. What was that? Lotori Knight's quest? Skeleton Mages. Apprentices. Mages? I can't remember. Oh, now we got leather shoes. Okay. Well, at least. No, we can't even. <laughs> We can't even wear them because they need seven decks. Dexterity. But hey, this sell for 300 gold, so that's that's cool. Hold on. Yeah. Two bad ears. And another filthy sludge. Two of them even. We are at full health, so that shouldn't be any problem. And there's a cave. A sewer. But I'm not going in there. <laughs> because I know what lies beyond that point. Four torches, okay. I'm gonna screenshot that. Um, however, yeah, four torches. That makes absolutely no sense, but okay. A topaz, nice. That's selling for 125. And another garnet. We 
we are still some way from our max carrying capacity. But we are running out of slots. <laughs> I love it, you know, when you just can't stand in, in one place and the enemies are spawning. And you just don't have to move on a ra oh, rusty steel chest plate. Plus one strength. Nice. Okay. Protection 15. Okay, but that's protection 28. Uh, how about no? Just gonna sell it. Sell it, not sell it. <laughs> ah, come on. Trainer's whip. Oh, yeah, that's the tool you need to tame uh, animals. I'm gonna show you. Uh, up there, there are cows that you can actually tame. And they follow you around. Now there's the one rums again. Oh yeah, and you shouldn't tame uh, the cows in town. Gods don't like that. <laughs> yeah, we've got a cow right here. And we use the trainer's whip on it. And let's see. Okay. Leadership is based on intelligence, but it's good experience, I mean, you know, just standing there and trying to tame that cow gives good experience. And sooner or later, we will be able to tame it. Yes, we did. Okay. And its name is Sunshine. And we're gonna set it to protecting us. We can't use, uh, we can't, yeah. We can only have one follower an out skill level. But now the cow is attacking our enemies. Well, the enemies that are attacking us. And voila! It killed that bat for us. I mean, it's just a cow, it's gonna die quickly, but still, it's fun. Uh oh. <laughs> Close one. Can I use a bandage on her? I don't know. Yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Okay, now she's back at full health. Whoa, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> I'm gonna lose her. I'm pretty sure about that. Oh, 
poor little sunshine. It's gonna die. Oh man. Oh no, she she's putting up a good fight. And every time she attacks, our leadership level goes up. And our overall level goes up. So that helps as well. Oh no, that's a quest uh, giving uh, item. Yeah, let's just, I don't know, get rid of that trainer's whip. And start that quest. It says, kill 40 black widow hatchlings. For Onyong Hazayu uh, of Lotus Summer Palace. Okay. We will eventually be able to do that. So, where's our trainer's whip? Well, okay. That's gone. But we only need 8,400 more experience and we're gonna head back to uh, that area where those uh, toads are yeah round trails do the trick as well so yay uh, you can't level your followers, so uh, a level 4 cow will always stay a level 4 cow until it dies. <laughs> so yeah, it doesn't level, but your uh, leadership level goes up. And you can have multiple cows or higher tier uh, animals to tame. And you can only tame non hostile uh, animals or um, mobs. Yeah. That always works well, you know. Uh, I'm taking the brunt now from those two mobs. And my cow is protecting me. And attacking the mobs that are attacking me. So we do double the damage. There's no need for healing. Okay. Then it's bugged. That window is bugged then. Okay. Just keeping an eye on the map. What's that? What's hiding there? Oh, cool. Truck rat and a filthy sludge. Let's maybe <clears throat> excuse me. Oh, ten strings. Nice. Come on, don't die, don't die, don't die. Ah, my poor sunshine died. Oh, too bad. So we need 
8,000 more experience. I mean, totally gonna do that with uh, trade skills now. Like spinning all the that. Oh, no. Wow, there are four filthy sludges. Yeah, that works. <laughs> Kindlings, not very useful. Yeah, but we got good loot. Another 11 strings? Come on. Thank you. And a slimy ooze. And another filthy sludge coming right at us. Hold on. experience to go closing that follower window because we don't need it anymore because our poor sunshine just died anyway it's all good it's all good no worries ah shoot another two onyxes Yeah, we're even close to uh, level 11 uh, small blades. The next important level I think is 14. Or maybe even 12. Let's see. Now we need... 3,600 more experience and still have enough carrying capacity we just don't have the slots <laughs> but then again I could just buy some leather bags you know, for the gems, etc. A fancy bow? Do you need that? Oh, I could use that sash. Protection 8? Yeah, totally. Ah, shoot. No, I have a full backpack. I can't use those leather shoes anyway, so I'm just gonna use that sash. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? Okay, that pays off. And we're getting two decks. And that bow sells for 400 gold. So that's probably worth it. Yes, it is. I'm not going much into archery. I mean, I could make a dex, a dexterity char, uh, just to show you my love for crossbows that I have on my main account. Oh, deceased. We're getting lots of springs. 
which is a lot. But, okay. Hold on. Only a thousand experience? Okay. Uh, that means... We are reaching the end. Of that stream of Ashen Empires. Just doing some more filthy sludges, etc. And then we will hit uh, level 17. Then I'm gonna unload everything uh, into the bank or sell the stuff I didn't need. And then I'm calling it a day. Well, for Ashen Empires, that is. I'm going to do another stream uh, of another game. Oh, another 10 strings. We've got like. Whoa! You are now level 17, and we need 122,000. For yay! Level 18, and we get another idol of Arna. Nice. Okay, we're gonna head back to town. With that war drum sound uh, of Kruk, a soundtrack of Kruk. Look, miss the entrance. Okay, let's just sell everything we don't need. Like, oh, come on. We won't cook it anyway, so let's sell those. Let's sell that. Rusty steel plate, defensive bow. Shield and belt. Now we got almost 2000 gold. That's nice. We're gonna unload the gems as well so we can sell them down. Thirteen onyxes, holy cow, and another two thousand. Yeah, we almost made four thousand gold during this run. Plus, we got some stuff for alchemy for later use, and we got a leather bag. Hooray! Bank the gold. Uh, then let's bank bad ears. The strings we're gonna need later. As well as the silk. Okay, let's put that silk out. Because we're gonna need that later. And the cloth. So we have more room for alchemy stuff, red tails, and skeleton bones, and have that idol of honor, those two idols, right here. Okay, um, everyone, that was... A good run, I would say. Uh, we made uh, a level in less than two hours uh, without power leveling, actually. Uh, it was a power hour, but uh, we weren't exactly power leveling. That's something I'm going to show you uh, during my next stream 
one of my next streams of Passion Empires, I'm going to do uh, some more Ashen Empire streams because it's just so much fun and I'll see you later with another game uh, that I'm streaming I'm not going to tell you I'm not going to spoil it in the meantime everyone have fun and I'll see you soon goodbye for now that smoke is always blowing right into the camera. I'm sorry. No, I'm not sorry. Um, yeah, but yeah. Okay. I'll see you soon. Goodbye for now. Goodbye, everyone.